Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Brighton and I am a part-time reseller on Poshmark, Mercari, and whatnot. All three of my links are in the description. And today I am, I'm opening the box right now. I got my hands on a thread up DIY jewelry box. There's the bag. I've had this for a while. I bought this back in June. So I bought this back in June. These boxes are $44 plus tax and shipping. I no longer pay shipping because I'm a VIT, very important thrifter. And yeah, so this came out to be about like 48 bucks for me, I think, right around $48. Um, this is what we're looking at. Guys, I'm going to try and be quicker today. Um, This is a cool looking feather earring, maybe. Um, ooh, I see some pretty, um, like, shell. I see something that may look like silver, maybe. I got something that looks like a, maybe, African turquoise. It looks like maybe some cameos. So, this actually looks really fun. Really, really fun. Um, yeah. So, I got this, like I said, back in June. I don't see any rings, which is what I'm looking for. But... Like I said, I bought this back in June. And I'm going to leave that right there so you guys can see me pull out some stuff. Oh, and that should be my thumbnail, maybe. There we go. I'm going to be my thumbnail right there. All right. Right there. And the first thing we have, let me back you guys up a little bit. Um, There we go. Yeah, it looks like you have an earring that actually kind of looks like silver. Um, no markings, but I think that might be silver actually. We'll see. I'll test it. Not probably gonna do any testing in this video. Um, because I don't even know where my testing house it is, actually. This is an unbranded fashion necklace. This will probably either just go on whatnot, um, or I might just take this to style encore. A little pretty little fasted necklace that's nothing really nothing crazy put earrings over here let me throw the receipt in the bag away like i said i'm trying to make this a quick video i'm trying to kind of try and keep these videos shorter um we have a little seed bead braided necklace um this is actually really pretty because it has these um rhinestones braided through it um, I will have to go over and make sure it's not missing any. Let me, there we go. Um, but it's pretty. That's pretty. Necklace. Um, looks like we already have a tangle. Ooh, that is so cute. I love this. I don't see any maker's marks. It feels like maybe like a tin or an aluminum. Really, really cute dog brooch. I like that. Um, we have an earring. Very statementy earring. I'll put earrings right there. We have another earring. Ooh, this looks like silver. Hold on, guys. Let's see. It is. It's marked nine two five and it does have an emblem next to it so we'll have to do some research that looks like maybe opal or abalone very pretty earring hopefully we get the match we have a little boho earring oh um let's try and oh we got the match to this one so that's good so we have the match to this one those are cute, very boho-y. Um, all right. So yeah, so I don't know when this video is gonna go up. I'm trying to pre-record some videos because I will be going out of town. Um, we are going to visit my sister um, up in Michigan, in like nowhere Michigan. It's pretty, little mother um, tiger's eye hoops. So. I'm trying to pre-film a couple videos just so I have some content pre-done. That way I don't have to stress when I get back. I don't have to stress when I'm there. Just pre-record them. Um, okay, 
Okay, this is hooked. Okay, I see the issue. I think we do not have this one. It's pretty. Um, so yeah, so I'm just going to pre-record a couple videos just so I have um, some content for you guys. I always try to have a Saturday video up. I have been trying to do a little bonus video here and there, like on Wednesdays, but hasn't really happened. Um, I just, I'm too busy. <laughs> I have a lot, I always have a lot going on. Um, but yeah, so I just wanted to make sure this feels like glass. That's pretty. I hope I can get this untangled. We're just gonna, oh, we have not did this earring. So there we go. Already got a couple matches. Okay, let's see. How can I untangle this? Okay. All right. So we got that untangled. So first one we have is this really pretty long seed bead dyed mother of pearl. Little necklace. Um, pretty. Then we have an antique brass little tassel necklace unbranded antique brass so oh um ring so what i'm wearing today i'm wearing a ring i got from my friend barb b-a-r-b-b-e-e -E on the whatnot um and i am wearing a malachite stretch bracelet that my good friend jennifer over at french teacher in virginia here on youtube um got me so super cute she says she got this for me on whatnot and i absolutely love it so that's what I'm wearing today. No other rings, just my simple band and my malachite. Um, let's see. This is an unbranded and it does have some wear. So that's unfortunate. Okay, we have a little bracelet. Yes, it is a bracelet. Um, it's interesting. This feels like suede. That does look like a real stone. So it's interesting. Um, this feels like a real stone as well. It looks, feels like some kind of natural stone. Um, and yeah, this is a big old chunk of glass. Clear and glossy in the front, frosted in the back. Is there a pin tag for this? This is a... This is a Rofsky! This is a Swarovski necklace. Oh my goodness. I've never, ever, ever seen a Swarovski necklace that looks like this before. Okay, so let me back this up. So it has this big old crystal right in the front. Okay. And then it has these like natural stone. This feels like an, maybe an obsidian or a lava stone of lava stone. Then it has these, all these like little crystals you know, going throughout. It has these dangles and has the natural stone. Um, and so it's marked with the swan on the clasp. Right there. If you can see that. And then it also has a hang tag that is marked with the swan. So, yeah, wow, okay. I will definitely have to do some comps on this. Swarovski usually does very well. Um, nice, okay, that's my first like, yay, really good, good piece. <laughs> okay, and then this is also marked. This is marked L-A-L-I-O-U-E. La Louis, La Louis. It's on like a braided cord. Um, and then it has like this like little opalite heart. It's very cute. Very cute and dainty. And then that's where it's marked. Um, the Louis. La Louis. L-A-O. No. L-A-U-O-L-E. I think. I don't know, but it's super cute. I'll look that one up. Um, okay, next we have a Banana Republic. Um, it has a, it does have some scratches on the hardware, but it doesn't look tarnished, which usually is the case. And this is like a snake skin. Hmm. So I have like one little pick right there, but 
That's nice. Banana Republic. I'll probably list that myself. Ooh, we have a big old ring. It is an antique um, silver tone. Probably like a size 7 or even a 6. Very cute. Um, okay, let's see. This is marked with a rhinestone, so this could be a loft. It could be a White House Black Market. It could be one of many brands. But it's definitely quality. I think we have the match to this earring. All right. This is like a fun little box. Okay. So next is um, this really pretty green. It's like a faux Kendra Scott. It is not a real Kendra Scott, but it's very pretty and it's in excellent condition. Um, looking at the gold tone, it looks really good. So that's a pretty one. It's probably a good whatnot piece. We have some hoop. Okay, what is this? This is unbranded. No, this is branded Chico's. So we do have a little Chico's necklace. Very pretty. It's like a gold, a silver, and um. It is Mark Chico's. The Chico's tag does have some wear on the Chico's tag, but the necklace itself seemed like it was in pretty good condition. Um, so yeah, Chico's. Nice. That's a listable piece. This, I think I accidentally... Okay, oh, look, we have the matching earring. So that is really pretty. So hopefully I can use Google Lens and that will pull up the maker. These are all singles single single okay um this the thing broke so this is just an, a simple fix it but it is unbranded and i probably won't get much for this anyways um so i don't even think i'll fix that but we'll see um another little unbranded necklace this one's pretty with the um zigzag unbranded this is a broken earring. So it's crapped. So I'll put it to the side because it looks like all it needs is an ear wire. And I can replace the ear wire. Um, this is not branded, but it looks like a lucky brand. It has cute little birds. And then it has like a little drop. A red acrylic um focus right there. A focus um statement, little pendant, multi-chain. That's pretty. I'll probably put that on and whatnot. And of course, like I, I always say, my whatnot is linked in the description. Um, and I always try to do shows on Sundays. I know I won't, of course, be doing a show on Sunday when I'm gone. But um, this is actually really cool. kind of reminds me of the tops of like a soda can. That's cool. Um, it's a little bracelet. I like that. and just dump all of this out. There we go. Okay, look, we got some earrings around the bottom that are match. Yay. Um, okay, we got some more earrings. Um, we have some new on the card earrings. We have a little bracelet. I have one very similar to that. Um, we got a missing... Okay, so that must be just something. Put that to the side. Okay, and I will show that. In the th okay, so let me just move. Ooh, I like this. I hope we get the match to whatever this goes to. That's really cool. Just faux turquoise, but it's still really cool. Um. Okay, let's look at this. Mm -hmm. I feel like I said I was going to make this a short video, and I feel like it's going to be a long video. <laughs> Okay, so we have, this is just fashion, I believe Avon, um, but it is a really cute set, and I will probably still list it, even though it's Avon. Um, it's like a cameo pendant and earrings, very pretty, and the reason I say it's probably Avon is because we can kind of see right there, there's like a circle with a dot in the middle of the circle, and it's on the earrings too. Avon does that. Um, 
Plus, it just looks like something Avon would do. So if I had to guess, this is definitely an Avon set. Um, but I'll list that because it's it's Avon. It's branded. Um, okay, this is a little earring. I think I have this exact earring already. Um, oh, it goes to this. So it's a set. Okay, so let's see what the set says. The set is a... KR? Smart KR. I don't know KR. Um, but we do have the earrings. No, this earring is bent out of shape, the ear wire, so we'll fix that. But we have a little set that's marked KR. I do not know that, so I will look it up. Um, we have now these are quite substantial. Simply Barbara. Um, they are vintage and they are a denim clip-on. So very interesting. I will have to Google that. <laughs> okay, let's get let's get one of this one of these bigger, chunkier pieces out of the way. And this is a really pretty um wood and um like a dyed howlite faux turquoise. This isn't howlite, this is like African turquoise, but this is howlite. Um, really pretty brass beads, very boho. This I would actually probably list myself. Those kinds of things usually do good. We'll see. We got some black hoops. At least it's matched. I will take it. So this is a now. Okay, I was about to say Stella and Dot, not um, uh, but it's not. It's not. I'm not sure what that one is, but it's a little puffy heart. I don't see any maker's marks. I do not believe it's silver. I believe it's just plastic, actually. So it's probably like a little no-name, little fast fashion, which is A-OK. -okay. Um, ooh, we got the match to the hoop. Okay, so this was best on my best piece so far, for sure. That and the, um, now it doesn't need to get bent. No, it doesn't. Okay, so that's how it goes. Really, really pretty. Let me get that in focused. Really, really stunning earrings. That are 925. There's the mark right there on the back. Really stunning. Love those. That is my favorite piece. Okay. Oh, this looks like silver. Let's see. Yes. Um, MWS Italy 925. Now I believe this is an inklet. Um, let's see. Yes. So it's an, either an inklet or about a not eight inch, an eight inch bracelet, maybe. No, it's an eight and a half, nine. It's a eight and a half to nine um, inch, nine to five bracelet. So that could actually be an inklet for me, but I'll probably sell it actually. Or maybe I'll keep it. I don't know. I don't know. Um, little fashion faux turquoise bracelet. Um... Ooh, I see silver. I see some liquid silver. Okay, this could be good. This, ooh, what's this? This looks like Brighton. Actually, no, this looks like real silver. Hold on, guys. This looks like silver. It is marked 925. Wow, okay. This is 925, and I'm assuming real turquoise. Um, On a leather chain, this is all silver as well, marked 925. Um... That's stunning. I like that. Little 925 turquoise necklace. Nice. 925, guys. Hmm. Yeah, I found a maker on that. That's awesome. Okay, I want to see what... <gasps> guys. Oh my gosh. This is stunning. Does this match those earrings? This is stunning. This is silver. This is for sure silver. It looks like there is a mark, but it's been worn. It's been very worn. Um, I don't know if you can see that right there. Looks almost like a native mark, maybe. Um, This is definitely silver. Hands down, this is definitely silver. <gasps> it fits me perfectly. Oh, this is a keeper, guys. This is a for sure keeper. Oh my gosh. This right here made the whole box worth it. 
Oh my gosh, I love this. <sighs> gorgeous, 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 gorgeous. Okay, I'm gonna put that with those opal um, earrings. Okay, that's awesome. This looks like there was silver in here. <gasps> Guys. Oh, this is for sure native. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Guys. Oh, my gosh. Okay, this is liquid silver. Hold on. Let me. Oh, my gosh. Look at, how... Look at this tangle. Guys, look at this tangle. Oh, my gosh. Um, This looks like silver, too. Oh, my gosh, guys. There's a lot of silver in here. Um, um, come on, <laughs> come on. Okay, I got this. Okay, it took me a second, but I got it untangled. And, um, this is native for sure. Let me show you the marks. So I don't know if you'll be able to see this. Let me move you up a little bit. Um, so it says sterling spelled out and then it has the rising like the sunrise rising the sun which i know that is a native mark um and it's marked sterling no that's marked 925 or is that mark sterling i can't remember. i can't see um and then it is the again the um rising sun sunset and marked sterling so this is all liquid, I believe it's called liquid silver um, beads. Um, and then it has this absolutely gorgeous opal, like Zuni style inlay. Oh. Guys, I'm definitely keeping this. Sorry, sorry, I'm keeping this. Oh my gosh. I think I already showed the mark. That is for sure a native mark. It has to be. Oh my gosh. This is all sterling. I think I don't think the pendant came on the necklace. I think they probably put the pendant on the necklace. Oh my gosh, I have the whole opal set. So it's, it's not an exact match. But look at that. And then I got the opal earrings. Look at that. Oh. Stunning. Stunning, stunning, stunning set. Look how pretty. Oh, guys, this right here, this this is well worth the 48 bucks for the box. I'm keeping all of it. <laughs> I'm sorry. I am keeping that. And then we got that sterling bracelet or anklet. And then we got that little leather and sterling. We got some good pieces, guys. And we still have more. Um, this is just a, um, barrel screw clasp with like mother of pearl, like shell, iridescent shell, um, necklace. That's pretty. I'll probably list that myself. This looks like sterling. It is marked China 925 and it is a mother of pearl, um, pendant on a suede. I would assume real suede since it's 925. Let me untangle this. Okay. Um, and then the clasp is also 925. So the clasp is 925, suede, 925, veil, and mother of pearl. So that's awesome. Okay. This box is possibly my favorite box I've ever opened. I mean, this might even beat my Tiffany box, guys. If you haven't watched that video already, go and make sure to go and watch my Tiffany unboxing. I have received Tiffany in these boxes. Okay, this is broken. Oh, no. Yeah, this is broken. Um, It's an easy fix. So I'll probably fix that. Um, Also, guys, you may see, like, weird, like, stopping and pausing um, in my videos. So my camera will only film so long, and then it basically, like, restarts. And it does it while I film. So there might be, like, a spot where it just, like, stops, and then, like, it keeps going. But it's, like, almost, like... 10 seconds later it's my phone um that's how it records once it hits like i can't remember if it's like 20 minutes or something like that it like stops and then starts recording again this is an unbranded rose gold little leather bracelet we have a little fashion earring i'm checking everything for marks um okay we have a this is a stellan dot or um Alex and Ani, I believe. Yeah, this is an Alex and Ani 
a wolf's spirit. So this actually might do good. Um, anything that has to do with wolves usually do good. It's cute. I'll look that one up. Guys, this box is so amazing. Uh, this might be my favorite box. <laughs> just, just, oh my gosh. Yeah, this is definitely my favorite box. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This is Brighton. Yes, it is. We have a heart clasp in the Brighton B. And this is a stunning, stunning Brighton faux turquoise, turquoise heart bracelet. Oh my gosh. And it's a little butterfly and a little heart and a little heart, a little butterfly, another heart, another heart. Um, I may keep this one too. <laughs> oh yeah. I like this a lot. Um, uh, I may sell it. I may. I don't want to hog everything, but wow. Oh my gosh. So we just got a Brighton heart bracelet. A turquoise, well, faux turquoise, I'm sure. Um, stunning, 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 stunning. Favorite, my, my, I, this might be my favorite box. This might be my favorite box. Okay. Um, <laughs> the only thing I'd make this better is if I got like another Tiffany piece. <laughs> we have a little lock and key necklace, unbranded, I think. Put that to the side. Um, this actually looks like a brain earring. Maybe not. Maybe not. Doesn't have enough like going on for it to be bright, and I don't think. Okay, we have a little stretch bracelet. Meh. Okay, look, we have another little set. This might be another Avon set, maybe. We'll see. Come on. Come on. Come on. Okay, this is. Okay, so the back has been bent completely out of shape but I can fix that right now so this one is still bent but I was able to bend this one back back together so I'm sure I can do the same for this so they're like the little black faux cameos um with little black rhinestones and then we have the matching yeah. pendant the pendant does have like some like something on there um so not sure on that but we have a really pretty little set. So I'll just have to clean that. I will probably list that myself as well. So a lot of pieces for me to list. Usually I I just put a lot of it on um, whatnot or um, buy, take it to buy, sell, trade for a quick buck. But I think there's a lot of me sell pieces, which is great. Um, that's good. <laughs> um, here we have another branded piece. Let's see. This is a... Oh, I know this one. You're something. I for keep forgetting that. It's I, it's. I don't think it's anything amazing, but it is really pretty. A little mother of pearl and shell. It's in pretty good condition, so I'll probably either I'll probably put that on whatnot. I don't know. It's shell, so that might be harder to list or harder to ship. Um, I'm think about that. We have a little earring. We have another earring. It's broken. This looks like silver, possibly. Hold on. Yes, this is this is 925 silver. So hopefully we get the match to this. So that's awesome. It's silver. Put that right there. Um, this looks like a matching earring to that necklace. Let's see if it's silver. I don't think so. So we do have the matching like well, we'll see. We shall see. Um, we have a little seed bead. Oh, look, we got the... Oh, wow, that's a fun earring. Let's unhook that. There we go. This is um, Liz Claiborne. So nothing crazy there. I'll see Liz Claiborne. It's pretty. We have the match to that one, so that's good. Okay, this is interesting. This is very, like, Asian, maybe, inspired. Um, toggle, clasp, tassel. I'm not sure about that one. These look like real pearls. 
Okay, so it says um, some. I don't know what that says. I don't think that's silver. Okay, so we have a bunch of these. Let's see, are any of them silver? Okay, that one says silver. So the double one is marked silver. So this one too, probably. Um, yes, yeah, so that's silver. So let's see, is this one silver? That one's not marked. Let's see. Okay, so I am back. <laughs> And so not, these ones are not Mark Silver. However, a couple of them seem to be silver. So we'll have to see about that. So those ones are not marked Silver, but they may be. And then we have these that are all marked 925. So these are all 925 Silver earrings. All of them are marked 925. So that's great. So that. I should be able to, you know, sell them for a couple bucks each for sure. So that's awesome. That's a good little baggie. <laughs> it's a good little baggie. Okay, we have, let's see, a memory wire. I know a couple people who love their memory wire bracelets. So that's an awesome one right there. And we have some stretchies. I had a couple requests for stretch bracelets, so I'll probably put that on whatnot. Um... This is cool little bolo. Let's get this. I don't really sell bolos, but this one's cool. So we have like a leather cord and then it has like a saddle. I'll use Google Lens to see if anything pops up, but it's not marked anything. Um, next we have a little puka shell. It is broken. So that's craft. Um, we have the another feather earring oh it looks like we didn't get the feather match okay so that's interesting oh no we did nope yes 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 we did okay so we got so we got this one so we have those those are pretty i think um i know a couple people who would like that um okay. we're kind of down to our last bit guys i'm not sure what these came off of so that's interesting Put that to the side because I'm sure we'll find what it goes to later on. Okay, this looks like it is marked 925 and it is. Well, 925 earring. I do not see the match. Um, oh, we do have the match to this 925 ear, um, earring though. So that's great. It's awesome. Okay, we have these. No markings. Um, okay, let's see. A little fashion earring. Okay, this is marked loft. This does have some wear. So this will be an this will not get listed. This will not get listed or sold on whatnot. This does have some wear, this loft necklace. So you can actually kind of see the color difference right there. Silver and bronze copper. So that's craft. Oh, ooh, look at this sterling earring, I'm assuming. Oh, it's Mart. It is Mart. Cheyenne? Shane? Cheyenne? I don't know. It's not marked up with a purity mark, but I know that's silver. Um, the earring back is marked 925. So that is a stunning coral earring. I'm assuming I have American. I do not see the match. Oh, we do have the match to this one, though. Um, so this one we do have the match too. So we got a nice bit of sterling in this box, guys. And I'll sell the earrings. Um, this one I might keep. Um, but I will sell the sterling. So that was a match. Put that there. Okay, okay. Let's hope we get that other sterling. Oh, we got the match to this one. That might be sterling. I'll have to check it over. Okay, I know this logo. That is the Lucky Brain logo. Let's see what we got. Um, let me pause. All right. I went ahead and untangled that. And this is a Lucky Brand antique gold tone. Little faceted black pendant there. And it goes down to this really cool like aztec -y Southwestern. And then it has like a long chain. So we have a three layer Lucky Brand necklace awesome um so that was cool i'll probably list that myself we have a little fashion a 
can untangle it. Okay, we have a little fashion, very southwestern looking again. This one I'll probably put on whatnot, maybe. We have a little earring. It's very pretty, very like J. Crew esque. Very pretty. Oh, guys, woo -hoo, woo -hoo. we got the match. So these, I believe, are native. And I don't know that marking either. Right there. I don't think you'll be able to see it very well. Yeah, I don't think you're going to be able to see that. But these are absolutely stunning and they are coral. Love those. Okay, so we got some really good pieces. We got some really good pieces. Okay. Um, earring. Earring. We got the match to Liz Claiborne, but that actually has some wear on it, so I don't know about that. Um, bunch of earrings. Let's just move these off to the side. Okay, here we go. Here's a piece. This is a no name, no name, but it has this cute little, um, little faux turquoise, or, um, I think this is Avon. Did Avon use that clasp? Oh, what is that marked? 14 karat gold plated, 14 karat gold plated. So that's pretty. I might list that myself like that. Let me back you guys out a little bit. There we go. Okay, I'm going to move some of these through this. Guys, man, this might be my favorite box. Yes, I know I've gotten Tiffany before. And, and, oh, we got the match of the J. Crew. Um, but this one actually might be my favorite um, because I'm, I love, love, love those native pieces. We have a little magnet that is a little chicken that is hilarious. Um, let's see. Okay, we have a little fashion necklace. Not sure why there's a clip when it doesn't have a clasp on it. Maybe it's a double layer. Not sure. We have a little knot. Let's undo the knot. So we have this one right here. And then we have this one. And then we have this one <laughs> and then we have this one so none of them are branded none of them are anything substantial oh we have this one so we have a bunch of little like little bracelets so not gonna sure what to do with all of those um oops sorry guys okay let's see we're on our last bit okay we have a little thank you if you're stuck through with me <laughs> Um, no class, which means it's probably not going to be branded, but it has this really, really fun, pretty, um, bedazzled rhinestone pendant with all this mother of pearl and like sea life charms. Very, very pretty long silver tone chain. Love that piece. I will probably sell that myself. We got the other boho earring. Um, okay, let's, let's get this untangled. The only thing that could have made this better was if we got like gold or Tiffany. <laughs> but I feel like for the most part, we got a really good box. This is a Chico's piece. Does have some scratches on it. So not sure on that piece. We have a little just fashion um but it's a hematite either bracelet or inklet not sure but that's hematite or magnesite i always get it confused um we have a little bracelet um or no it's a choker it's a choker we have a little fringy um stretch bracelet that's actually really cute okay so here's the earring that we have that's broken no marks on it so what i'm probably do is take the clasp off of this and put new clap new earring hooks on it um next we have a 
unbranded little double layer. I actually have a bracelet that would go with this perfectly. Um, little feathers, rhinestones, cord. I'll probably just put this on whatnot. Um, that's a really cool one. We're on our last bit, guys. Oh, guys, that's actually really cool. Okay, let me show you. I don't know the brand of this. Hold on, let me plug you in. My phone is dead. There we go. Um, but this is actually not a magnet. Well, I mean, it is a magnet, but it's an interchangeable pendant. So you can have the pig, take off the pig, you can put the, um, the um, rooster, chicken. That's so cool. I don't know the brand. Um, oh, it is. It's marked with a little cow. So if anyone knows what brand that is, please let me know. So I'm just going to throw that on the back. So that's awesome. I actually might list that. Um, let's see. Okay, we have a little sea life. This is just unbranded. It has, looks like real shells on it, though. Um, yeah, this is like real shells. That's really pretty. I'll probably put that on whatnot. Oop. Keep moving into you guys. Okay. Oh, look, we have the matching hematite necklace that goes with the bracelet. So we have the necklace, and then I thought we had a bracelet somewhere. Where did the bracelet go? Not sure where I put the bracelet. Okay. Um, stretchy adjustable cord necklace. Well, this is marked with a C, so this is copyrighted. Um, just not sure what the copyright is for because there is no branding on it. Hmm. Interesting. All right. And then we have a bunch of layers. Um unbranded but we have like this three layer necklace and it's these really pretty colorful beads um so the first layer is a tassel and the second layer is another tassel and then we have a third tassel beads on that one like that i might list that i don't know it's mart i thought it was another three layer um the three layer necklace so that's cute. We have another little stretchy. We have another little stretchy. And then this actually looks like silver. This is marked 925. They're little koala bears. They're a little koala bear bracelet. That is adorable. It's marked 925 here. It's marked 25 on the clasp. That is so cute. Little koala bear necklace. That's so cute. All right. Oh, and then we have this bangle. So not sure what these little beads went to. Um, so not sure if I missed something or not. But okay, favorite pieces, the koala bear, the um, opal bracelet, the Native American opal necklace. Um, this is insane, guys. Um, literally insane. Um, the Paul Bear, okay. The possibly native, I'm assuming native earrings. The 925 starfish earrings. The 925 pearl, and I forgot the name of that. I don't think it's coral. I think it's some kind of natural stone. 925. And then these stunning 925 in either opal or abalone. Stunning. Um, and then we got a couple other pieces that were really good. Those were the sterling. Um, I thought we got another sterling piece. I thought it was like a leather. Yep. Yeah. We have the sterling and leather necklace. That was a good one. Um, we got the Brighton Charm bracelet which was super cute. My phone's right in the middle of the, okay. Um, let's see, we got this thing that's smart, something. I don't know what it's smart, but it's really cute. 
Oh my gosh, I forgot. We got the um we got that really really cool um Swarovski necklace. So we got the Swarovski necklace, the Lucky Brand necklace, the other 925 little little bracelet. Let me pull that 925 bracelet. Um Swarovski necklace. The Swarovski necklace. And we got a couple Chico's pieces. The super cute dog brooch. Oops, sorry guys. The super cute dog brooch. Um Chico's. Chico's. Thought we got one of the Chico's piece. I don't know. Oh, and then we got the little 925 Little Mother Pearl necklace. So we got two Chico's necklaces, the Avon cameo set, the Lucky Brand. Oh, and all of these 925 earrings. Yeah. All right, guys. So that was my box. That was really, really good. Um, Maybe possibly one of my favorite boxes. Mm, my second favorite. My favorite box is the one where I got the Tiffany ring because that's like my absolute favorite ring ever. Um, But this is a very close second. I mean, we got the Brighton Charm bracelet. We got the 925 in leather and turquoise necklace, which is awesome. Hold on, guys. Let me do that. Um, Really pretty. We got the little 925 possibly little opalite heart. We have the 925 bracelet. We have the absolutely, absolutely, absolutely stunning um, native opal um, pendant. The 925 earrings. These 925 earrings. Where did the other one go? Here it is. Um, these 925 earrings. These 925 earrings. 925 bracelet. The 925 necklace the absolutely stunning cuff bracelet, the dog, the 925, and then the, this is Swarovski. So guys, yeah, this is, I love this box. Definitely keeping a, some of these items, but not everything. I will be listing probably all of the earrings. Um, so if there was anything that you were interested in, just give me a, um, an email. Um, it does take me a minute to respond back to emails. So just please be patient with me. But yeah, that was a really good box. If you liked it, please give this video a thumbs up. I would greatly appreciate it. Go ahead and leave a comment what your favorite piece was. Um, there was so many in this box. There was some really good pieces in this box. So yeah, if you wouldn't mind just giving me a thumbs up, leaving me a comment. And if you haven't subscribed already, please go and do so. Like I said, I do have my Poshmark, Mercari, and whatnot all linked in my description. So if you want to check out my Poshmark closet or want to come to one of my Sunday at noon um, whatnot shows, or if you would like to sign up for Flip, F-L-Y-P, um, which is a free cross-listing and um, Poshmark closet share app um, site, go ahead and do so. Sign up with my links. I would greatly appreciate it. And I will see you guys in the next one. Thank you, thank you, thank you for watching. Bye, guys.